Hello everyone, welcome back to Factorio! Oh my god, I almost forgot the name already. Oh, I am so bad. <laughs> but welcome back everyone! So today we are going to upgrade some belts and we are going to upgrade, well, some other stuff. But first, belts. Okay, so what do we need for belts? Apparently our research is going because I see a lot of transport belt going up. Let's actually uh, speed that up now that I think about it. Let's do this. That should be better. There we go. I've got some more research. What should we get? Some lasers, electronics. What can we get with electronics now? Robots. Ooh. Robots. Construction robots. Then we can make more. Oh, this is all green science. Oh, that is nice. Uh, okay, we're gonna get robots. I need this. I need robots in my life. Okay, so we are going to make some transport belts. Now, what do we need actually for the red ones? We need more gears. For this one we need the yellow ones. And for this one we also need the yellow ones. So I guess if we are going to upgrade everything here, what we should do is just put this all into a next factory maybe. Uh, but is there a good way to do that? I think I'm going to leave this one here. Uh, that one will be separate because that one is needed for research. And it will make also some yellow ones which is also good. Uh, yeah, so I think what I want to do is first let's pick up all this and let's pick up you and you. I think I want to do that. Yeah, okay. Come in me robots. I need you. Uh, okay, so also I'd like to reset the line here a little bit. Oh, I didn't want to do that. So what I'm thinking of is putting everything into or from the one into the other to do something like this. And apparently they're still going. I should cut this off from power, but I can't really do that at the moment. And then there will be another assembly machine here. Right about here. Like so. And this one will need a blue inserter. And then these all need gears as well. So do they need iron? Um, do they need iron? No, they only need gears. And this one needs electronic circuits. Okay, so I think one of the good things to do here is to split this off to here and make the splitters there. But I think I want a... Because we need a buttload of gears and I can pull them off from here. But I already have iron here, so I might as well do something different. What I'm going to do is set this up already. Like this. Give this some belts. Like so. And then here we're gonna make, I guess, one of these. Have a fast inserter. And an outputter. And this is the wrong way around. And then over here we're gonna have a belt with gears. And this is all gonna be outputted onto the copper field, which is not ideal, but we'll deal with it. So this one is gonna make gears. This one is gonna make No, no, underground belts. Underground belts. Underground. Fast transport belts, fast splitters, and then we need outputs, we need inputs as well here. And then we need output chests, there, there, and there. And they need to be limited. Splitters, I want one stack. Belts, I want this. Underground belts, I'd like this. And that looks like it is hooked up correctly. Now it needs iron. And I have an itchy nose. And now I need some power. I didn't do this correctly. If I want to do this kind of the same. Uh, well, I guess we can't really help it. Inserter. There we go. Power that one up. Power that one up. And power this two up like this, I guess. And then we should have everything here. And when this one is filled up completely. Oh, this one will of course keep going now. 
Uh, which means... I might need to speed this up. Let's see how quick we can make this thing. Mm, not quick enough, apparently. Let's, uh... Maybe slow this one down. Like so, maybe? Actually, let's just do this differently. I think I want more... Uh, gear wheels being made here. And power. There we go. Double those. That should be good. There we go. Now it's being made. This one needs an inserter here. A fast one. For the rest of your ingredients. Mm, and apparently you're not getting circuits yet because you're still filling up with iron gear wheels. Oh well, oh well, it will be fine. So at least we our drain on our gears here is not as big as it sh uh, has to be. But we are creating a lot there. I might just split those off anyway. Yeah, let's, let's split them off anyway. And when we need gears, we can have the gears here made from iron as a backup. I guess that can be done. So let's do this. Let's do this. There we go, that's a lot more gears. This will take so many gears. Then also we can speed that one up because we're getting so many gears now. What I actually want to do is I want a lot of gear, a lot of belts at the moment. So let's just make them double, double those up so this can be quicker. There we go, okay. Now the thing I'd like to do is if I'd like to fill you up with all the belts I have. Fill you up with all the underground belts and I is again have an uneven amount. How the hell did I get an uneven amount? I don't know. I really have no clue. I think actually what I also can do here. Oh, 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 oh. Uh, that is wrong. Yep, that is correct that you need to make those, but that's wrong. <laughs> you need to make these. And let's put you in there. There we go. That's an output. Oh, and apparently I have 50 more. Let's put those also in here somewhere. Like there. That could work. Oh, dang it. That didn't work. Um, ah, dang it. Oh, dang it. I am doing all the wrong things here. There we go. You need to be dead. And you need to have my splitters. Like so. And you can have my other splitters. And now we have four left. And I guess those are going to be, well, there. <laughs> okay, so let's put on a light. And apparently I'm out of lights then. Am I out of lights? I am completely out of lights. Okay, let's make some lights. Okay, that's going on. Okay, in the meantime, we are gonna reset this area here. So I'd like to unselect all these. And make these here. Then this is going to be underground belts. And this is going to be fast splitters. And let's grab some of all these. There we go. Now we've got underground belts. Oh yeah. Can you have a few more of these? There we go. Ah, there we go. Now we can see that the gears are not keeping up. But that's why we have two extra machines here. Okay, that will work. And my music is a little loud. There we go. Okay, so we are gonna make another line here with more stuff we are gonna create. And what is that going to be? Well, we eventually will need these. That is stuff we do need. But I'd like to first automate some um, pipes. Which is pure iron, which we can make over here. Because pipes will are annoying to make, mostly because the... Underground pipes will need 10 normal pipes. I'd like a lot of those just stored up for immediate use. And we were gonna start it about here. Like so. So this one is gonna make pipes. This one is gonna make underground pipes. Uh, how, what do we need for pumps? Electric engine units. I don't have those yet because those will need lubricant. 
and a lubricant is not something I have at the moment. Okay, so let's do this and this and this and I'll put these here into some chests. And we're going to limit the chest. You are going to be limited to here and you are going to be limited less because I think I need more underground ones than others. But we need to power this like so. And this is just going to uh, go to town. And it will take some time. This is keeping up nicely. I like it. And this will just uh, take some time before... Uh, well, before that starts working. But I don't really need those now at the moment. So that doesn't really matter. Also, one thing I'd like to automate is these. The storage tanks need iron and steel. Uh, we don't have steel on the bar yet. so Or here on this side yet. So we need those. And these are just taking a long time to make, so I'd like to automate those. And also what we can do is start automating electric power poles, medium ones, and the big poles, which is copper and steel. So I guess we're going to have copper and steel on one side of a belt here. I guess we're going to use the fast ones because we're now upgraded to that one. And apparently I already have an uneven amount of fast. How the hell do I do that? Oh my god! I have no clue. Oh, I can't make that quite. Well, I'd like to make that like that. So we will put you over there with a fast on the ground thing. More fast thing there. And you are going to be limited to two on one row. How far are you? You are going there. Mm, okay, so here we go with those. I needed uh, copper and steel. And I'm just lazy. <laughs> there we go. Copper and steel. Really, how the hell did I get one underground belt there? I have no clue. And this is going to go underground here as well. Till there. That's copper and steel. Okay. There we go. And now we need a few extra assembly machines. I'm only using blues now. And let's just make them those and have the spacing between. Because it looks nicer if you have them all the same. Mm, you are going to have those. You are going to have these. Uh, maybe actually I want this to be uh, engine small pumps later. So let's actually move this one up. Just for future planning. I'm not really sure how many pumps I will need eventually, but uh, I don't know. And let's do it like that. These have a lot bigger range, so I like those more. And I'd like them outputted on this side as usual. Or should I just put them over here? Nah, let's put them on the other side. We have nothing here yet, so we might as well do it like this. Okay, so engine units, how much? We need steel and those. Okay. It uh, doesn't really matter to me. I've been looking at a, uh, a remix is a big word, but a different kind of song for Rohibium Rhapsody. And it was epic. It was a, a, a clip, I guess, made by... Oh my god, I forgot the name already. But it was epic. <laughs> it was really epic. It was... Um, done magnificently i completely forgot the name Cor Cor corridor digital i think corridor digital if i if i think about it i will link it in the description <laughs> oh yeah this is the last thing i need i'd like storage tanks let's actually make storage tanks in this thing because we're not going to use that one and we need iron and steel for that so which means an inserter on this side and on that side and an output on this side in a chest why am I making those like this? Because they just take a long time. And I don't really care for crafting stuff in my pockets if I can help it. I'd like to do it somewhere else. There we go. Okay, let's uh, get some pipes in the inventory. So this one is not so empty. And also let's get this. So this is, this is nicely filled up. How's my belts going? I need more if I can. Ah, oh, it's going nicely. Good, good. How is this going? Looks like my iron supply is dwindling. 
So how is my iron supply going? Too slow on this line. Oh, and I'm putting it all the wrong directions. There we go. This is not really balanced at the moment. I should actually balance it. Uh, yeah, so how do I balance this? Well, I balance this by getting it out here. This will... Well, this can be yellow, so let's keep the yellow here. There we go. And then we can balance this line and be done with it, actually. So let's just do this. Do this. Oh, my God. I'm moving so quick suddenly. <laughs> there we go. That's a balanced line. And that should hopefully balance everything. Now, this one is not really balanced here. Why are you... Oh, hello. Uh, this is not good. There we go. We have coal, etc. on the belt still. I thought I got rid of that, actually. Oh my god, I got so many iron in my bar. There we go. Get it out of there. Uh, why is that? I thought you should be picking up the coal. Are you not quick enough? We could use 1,000 or 10,000 electronic circuits. Well, you should be quick enough. There should have enough iron coming in at least. But I still see coal indeed going through everything. And that this coming from you. Why is that? Hmm, I should really just mine that one out by myself. This one should produce more coal, but apparently that one... Is not having problems. Oh well, I guess it's uh, it was just a hiccup. Let's just hope it was a hiccup. Let's hope it will just be fine. Here we got more coal. It's just the last thing down there. Okay, that should be a little more iron production. How's the copper going? The copper is going well. Steel is going fine as well. Everything is going reasonably good here. The only thing needed is maybe some more smelting for iron at the moment. Well, not really at the moment, because at the moment the lines are full. And this whole system here is going, only we are not doing any research. Mm, what do we need for those robots? We need engines. We need, we need engines. Okay, let's get engines. Okay, that means our research or our resource drain will be a little higher, but uh, it should be fine. Okay, so we have automated this section over here. I'd like to get actually some of these medium power poles, and I'd like to uh, get those on the bar as well. So let's get rid of those. Put the medium ones there. And empty these out for one stack. And empty these out for one stack. And you are going to be over here, I guess. Was I creating these? Yes, I was creating these. You can go in... Where are you? Where are the old assembly machines? There we go. And I got these old stone furnaces, which I don't need anymore. I don't need a lot of this. Let's make a, uh, a obsolete chest. A chest where I can just dump stuff in here next to the water. Ooh, a fishy. Haha, <laughs> I got fish. <laughs> I got food. Nom nom. Okay, let's get in that. That one. The wooden power poles. And I think that is most of the stuff. Okay, what do I now want to do? I think I'd like before... I, I know I need to get into oil pretty soon, but I'm going to do that later. Uh, first, I'd like to get most of the stuff going towards my base. Like, for example, the stone here. The moment we're putting this in a chest, and apparently this chest is completely filled up. It is. Uh, what we should do is make some furnaces here, some steel furnaces automatically so I can start making them in big amounts if I need to. Uh, but the best thing I might do is just make them up here. We have some space there and I don't really mind it having there. How full are you? You are completely filled up. Mm, let's uh, do this. Uh, let's get, re get you. 
Let's get you and dump it all in there. Except for maybe a few stacks. I got a buttload of iron on me, actually. Uh, let's uh, mm, do that. Take a few stacks with me. There we go. Oh, that's the wrong thing to break. Oh, well, I guess we're going to have a fast belt there. Okay, so I'd like to bring some steel up. What I think I'm going to do then is I have not enough space here. Hmm. Hmm. I have enough space here, though. Because this is yellow and this is red, ink can cross like this. Oh yeah. <laughs> Done it. And now... Oh. We let's go at least a little through here, so it does end up with a little less space. There we go, and let's hook it, disconnect it there, so we don't really get a lot of uh, stone in our inventory. Okay, and that will move through here. This can stay here for now. So, how much do we need for this? And how fast is it created? Steel furnaces. We need 10 stone and 8 steel. My god, and it takes 3 seconds. That is a long time. But we are going to make that factory in the next episode. So I hope you enjoyed this one. Please leave a like on it if you did. And I hope to see you all tomorrow with another episode. Have a wonderful day, everybody. Bye-bye.